Welcome to Console War Smash Fest. Celebrating 3,000 subscribers on Timmy Menard's channel, the icons from Nintendo, Sega, Sony, and Microsoft will fight in an itemless sprawl to see which company makes the best consoles from the early 80s to the present. Representing Red Team and Team Nintendo, the leading ladies of gaming, Princess Peach and Princess Daisy! The blue team and representing Team Sega, Mega Man, and Sonic. The Sony PlayStation mascots representing Yellow Team, Cloud, and Snake. Microsoft veterans and newcomers for Ultimate representing Green Team, Banjo Kazooie, and Steve. One of these four teams will win the Smash Fest and become the best console manufacturer in video game history. All battles will be fought in retro themed stages. The first team to win five times will become Console Wars Smash Fest winner. With that out of the way, let the Smash Fest begin! Again, our console war smash fest in the Martian Kingdom from Super Mario Brothers with the crown being coming from the same game. One of these four teams will win the console wars and become the best console manufacturer of all time. Will it be Team Nintendo, Team Sega, Team Sony, or Team Microsoft? We'll have to see who wins five times to answer your question. Strike one. Strike one for Cloud, Snake, and Mega Man. Strike one for Daisy. And remember, you lose three lives and you're out. Pretty much like baseball, so you lose strikes and you're out. Strike one for Sonic and strike one for Peach. Strike one for Steve. Strike two for Mega Man. One more strike, and he's out. Strike two for Cloud. One more strike and Cloud is out. Strike two for Peach. One more strike and Peach is out. Strike two for Daisy. One more strike and Daisy is out. Strike two for Sonic. One more strike and Sonic is out. Strike three. Cloud is out. Strike three. Mega Man is out. Strike two for Banjo. One more strike and Banjo is out. Strike two for Banjos. No, strike three for Banjos, Steve, and Snake. They're out. And with that, Team Sony and Team Microsoft loses. 
What a great way to end the first battle. We have the console wars brawl that started it all. Nintendo versus Sega. It looks like Team Nintendo is nothing but females, our two leading ladies of gaming. And Team Nintendo takes game one for the series. We begin battle two in Green Hill Zone from Sonic the Hedgehog. And also, we're also in Green Hill Zone. It looks like these princesses are giving their all today. Or this evening, wherever you live in. Strike one for Snake. Right, one for Sonic. Right, one for Steam. Right, one for Banjo. Right, one for Cloud. Strike one for Daisy. Strike two for Steve. One more strike and Steve is out. Strike two for Cloud. One more strike and Cloud is out. Strike two for Snake, one more strike and Snake is out! Strike one for Peach! Strike three, Steve is out. Strike two for Daisy, one more strike and she's out. Strike two, one more strike and Mega Man is out! Strike two for Peach, one more strike and Peach is out! Strike three, Snake is out, and with that, Team Sony loses. Strike three, Banjo is out, and with that, Team Microsoft loses.
Oh, look at these princesses. They're not giving up. They got the strong willpower, and they're gonna show that even girls can be just as good as boys, but it's girl power. Anyways, strike three, Sonic is out. That's game two for three, Team Nintendo. Three more wins, and they got the console war smash fest. Anyways, our third battle will take place in Minecraft. Kind of interesting, actually, because Minecraft is like a 2D looking game, but played in three dimensions. It does kind of fit, to be honest, because this is console wars. And anyway, strike one from Mega Man. Strike one for Banjo. Strike one for Snake. Strike one for Steve. Strike one for Daisy. Anyway, strike two for Banjo. One more strike and Banjo is out! Strike two for Mega Man. One more strike and Mega Man is out! Strike one for Peach. Strike three or not yet. Strike three, Sonic is out. Oh yeah, Banjo is out. Look at the crowd! We're cheering for our cute pink princess. I think she deserved the cheer, to be honest. Team Sega loses. Strike three, Daisy is out. Strike two for Peach, one more strike and Peach is out. Strike three for Steve. Team Microsoft loses. And look at that, we end Battle 3 with Nintendo versus Sony. Strike 3 for Cloud, he's out! One more big snack for Peach, and Team Nintendo wins Battle 3. Our fourth battle will take place in the Martian Kingdom where it all started. Two more wins for Team Nintendo and they become Console War Smash Best Winner. Strike one for Snake. Strike 
one for Steve. Strike one for Daisy. Strike two for Steve. One more strike and he's out. Strike one for Banjo. Strike two for Mega Man. One more strike and Mega Man is out. Strike three for Steve. He is out? Strike one for Peach. Strike two for Daisy. One more strike and she's out. Strike two for Banjo. One more strike and he's out. Strike three for Steve, he's out! Strike two for Cloud, one more strike and he's out! Strike three for Mega Man, he's out! Strike three for Banjo. Team Microsoft loses. Strike three for Daisy. She's out. Strike three for Sonic. Team Sega loses. It looks like Nintendo has already won Battle 4. That's game 4 win for Team Nintendo, with one more win for Team Nintendo, it looks like we're about to have a console slash best sweep. Nintendo wasn't messing around and their video game handling, now it's back then gets my points wrong. Looks like it's strike one for Snake. Strike one for Banjo. Strike one for Sonic. Strike one for Daisy. Strike two for Snake, one more strike and he's out! Looks like Sony ain't giving up yet. Looks like Cloud wants to spare our life for Snake. I can strike two for Cloud. One more strike and Cloud is out. Strike two for Daisy. One more strike and Daisy is out. 
Looks like it's strike one from Mega Man. Strike two for Sonic. One more strike and Sonic is out. Isn't it great seeing the TQ princesses win the Smash Fest? I bet you are. We'll see you later on. Strike two for Banjo. One more strike and Banjo is out. Strike three for Snake, he's out! Strike one for Peach! Strike three for Daisy, she is out! Strike three for Cloud, he is out! Team Sony loses! Strike three for Sonic, he is out! It looks like we have Microsoft, Sega, and Nintendo for this fight. It looks like Peach and Steve are evenly tied for the moment, but things can change very shortly. No, it looks like Steve is on his second strike. One more strike and Steve is out! Strike three for Banjo, he is out! Strike two for Peach, one more strike and Peach is out! And it looks like it comes down to Microsoft, Sega, or Nintendo. But apparently, Team Nintendo is in the lead. Our MVP throughout the entire Smash Fest is Princess Peach. Apparently, the outlook is looking good for Nintendo. And seeing what's going on for this fight, it's my point of view. Looks like Team Microsoft loses. And it's up to Peach to win the Smash Fest. Will she do it? She's almost there. Will it be enough now? Yes! And with five wins in a row, our console for Smash Fest winner is Team Nintendo! Good game, everybody. Good game. Five wins in a row with Peach and Daisy. Now that's incredible. This video was made not only to celebrate the 35th anniversary of the Nintendo Entertainment System, but to also celebrate 3,000 subscribers on my channel. If you enjoy the content I do uh, on my channel, leave a comment, like, and subscribe.
Sorry about that, Microsoft, but at least you are best buddies with Nintendo, so it's all good. You still have great consoles anyway. Sega did a mediocre job handling their consoles and their Game Gear was no exception. It went downhill after the Genesis and it was game over for Sega and the console race after the Sega Dreamcast failed to live to its full potential. When Sony entered the fray, everything looked like a laughingstock in their eyes seeing their success with the PlayStation and PlayStation 2. Not even the Dreamcast can handle the PlayStation 2's success thanks to DVD support from the latter. Prior to the Nintendo Switch, Nintendo's gullible behavior relying on a portable console alone made them nothing but second best compared to Sony. With Nintendo winning the Console Wars Smash Fest and Sony's PlayStation 2 no longer having repairs, Nintendo's comeback with the Nintendo Switch has made me realize that Nintendo doesn't have to be in the console race to win. Anyways, until next time, I'm Timmy Menard signing off. Later!